Right, schools are closed, graduation is on hold, and parents and CCSD teachers have a lot of questions as we head into the final months of school. 13 Action News reporter Jeremy Chen spoke with Superintendent Dr. Jesus Jara one on one here to get some answers for all of us. Jeremy. Yeah, Tricia, you know what, with this school year, it's particularly strange, especially for all the students here at CCSD. And for them, they're just trying to figure out things where to go forward. And the superintendent says he's looking to listen to the students, especially the high school seniors. Closed school campuses mark the current reality of education during the coronavirus pandemic. When will CCSD schools reopen remains a question. Superintendent Jesus Jaro says if schools come back, there are challenges to overcome. The staffing, uh, the ability to get staff to come back, our students with the social distance. Jara says he's been in contact with various state officials, including the governor's office and the state superintendent, for any signal reopening would be possible. He says in the short term, the closures remain. We don't see how we can we, we can open school brick and mortar buildings uh, to bring everybody back um, by May 1st. Graduation plans were also on the mind of Dr. Jara. He met with student body presidents from the district's high schools this week and heard one clear consensus. What they really said, no virtual graduation. They want to see their classmates. They want to walk across the stage together. Jara says he respects the views of students and is working with principals with that in mind for a possible event in the summer. Is it August? Is it July? when so we're trying to figure all of this out and, and come up with a decision now schools at ccsd will remain closed until april 30th that leaves about three weeks of school left then now coming up at six we're going to hear more from jesus jar about grading and the inequities he's looking to address jeremy chet 13 action news yeah a lot of